An ox cart ought to make our journey easier. It would allow us to save our strength. The plan. Assuming we are not attacked, that is. This ox cart. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Ox cart away. Eventually, when I just get around here, we go. Oh, yeah, there you go. Just right here. Is that the guy that's been... That guy just ah, fucking sprinted. Here we are. The ox cart made it without too much trouble. Mayhap we can employ a cart for our next journey. You. <laughs> my my, I'm trapped like a rat in a cage. This arisen's both shrewd and fleet of foot. Why are you following me? What? Can't you think of a reason? I'd thought you a keener wit than that. Let's just say there are some who don't want you wandering about as you please. I was to report on your comings and goings, you see. But I suppose that job's over. Now you found me out? So, how about it, friend? Will you let me go? I've no reason to trouble you any further. Refuse or demand compensation? Sure, refuse. Understandable. Still, no harm in asking, was there? Let's get this over with then. Ah! Josh, you're gonna have to get around that first. Damn, bingo! Just put him in the ground and stab him until he died. Reviving the dead. If a resident of this world dies, it is not necessarily the end, for the risen has the power to revive the fallen by using a wake scone in close proximity to them. Bear in mind, however, that the bodies of the dead are not left to the mercies of the elements. However, that the bodies of the dead are not left to the mercies of the elements, but will, in short order, be taken to a morgue or car or charnel car house in one of the larger cities. No. Fuck you, guy. Well, at least I figured out what that quest was when I saw that guy. The arisen was that not arisen shadow. Oh, that was just a random dude. <laughs> That's, that was something completely different. Are you fucking kidding me? There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's okay. claim as a true arisen. Oh, right, here we go. We got Queen Regent. Queen Regent. Tell me the magistrate. I bring word of Melv. Tell me of the masquerade. Yeah, I'm gonna talk about Melv. So the acting chief of Melv was blamed. I suspect this is some ploy of the Queen Regent and her ilk to lay claim to the village territory. Mm hmm However, I've heard no report of her capture as of yet. Yeah, she escaped. It may well be that she is safe. Perchance. She has fled somewhere outside of Deesa's reach. Is there aught else you would speak of, Your Majesty? Yeah, who's this false sovereign? While examining the palace ledger for evidence of the Queen Regent's misdeeds, I made a curious discovery. For some time now, it seems, she has been diverting a veritable mountain of gold to the daily purchase of sweet crown flower. What's more, this inexpedient spending habit is recorded to have begun the very day on which Arthur, the would-be arisen, appeared on the scene. Okay. This yeah. cannot be mere happenstance. I can only conclude that these sums are passing into the hands of Arthur himself. That makes sense. Yet, yeah, tis strange, for sweet crown flowers only grow on the eastern edge of Roman. I dare say, twas not an item chosen idly. 
Mayhap this knowledge will guide us in our pursuit of the False Sovereign? Tis a frail hope to be certain. Yet all the same, I would ask that your majesty venture to Vermont's eastern edge and probe into this young man's origins. Okay, we haven't been to the eastern side of this place. I am glad to hear it, for I cannot shake the... F but he's not here again. No concept where he's at. No one here's done the quest. <laughs> uh... Venture to the eastern edge of Vermund and uncover what you can of the false origins origins. Oh yeah, it's way over there. Okay. Okay. I guess we're going to we're going to just travel out this way, go down here. Oh, yo, there's a dragon over there. Way over in the uh the mountains. Or is that a griffin? I think it's a griffin actually. I gotta see the bald eagle head going. Hey, follow me. I'm following you. Oh, there's a hole in their house. Meaning there's a cave entrance somewhere? Didn't I buy Quicken Spell? Why don't I have Quicken Spell? I thought I bought it. Yeah, I got Quicken Spell right here. How do we Quicken Spell? Hold left trigger while chant. Well, and. So do I do this? And then you quicken spell. Oh. That's very quick. <laughs> okay, I thought you held down left trigger and that brought up spells. Like, I, I thought you were going to hold left trigger down and that would bring up all your spells like switching skills, but would then cause them to be quicken spelled like the archer aims a bow and shit. But apparently that is not the case. I find it hard to believe there'd be a, a cave leading all the way over there unless, well, maybe this this edge piece here could be a cave leading there. Uh, hello. We're under attack. Boop, 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 boop. Ooh. Ah. at that spell because it's not a part of the thing okay good job guys yep I don't gotta do shit Ripened. There's a ladder here. Hey, well, this goes to the house, I betcha. Yeah, it does. Uh, all right, stop sprinting. Just open the damn thing. Silver ore. Nice. I just recalled a little tidbit I heard from the locals. Regarding the Vermundian military, yes. Indeed. Tell is, there's been a shift in the chain of command.
Oh, that's a big something. Is that a, is that a ch chimera? No, that's a cyclops. That's a cyclops. Get a helmet time. Okay, so lightning bolts do not follow the target. First and foremost, not to lock it off balance. It's a much easier target when lying prone. This battle will demand thank you. I am in your debt. Fantastic. And that leveled me up like I was hoping it would. And we're going to just head south from here. I've just recalled. I found a treasure chest near here during my travels beyond the rift. Oh. I'll show you to its location. Oh, uh, first things first. Undead. Zombies. Holy attacks are our best bet against this foe. Will you give it to her for fuck's sake? This is why the upgraded version needs to be an AOE. Now, what might that be? We ought to take a closer look. Oh, ah. secret token. Now here's a surprise. Our collection grows. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. Well, he found a chest here, but not a token. Or maybe it was someone else. More tarring arrows. The undead have risen to face us! Fire! Hey, she's maxed out and... Oh no, that's an Alahoon. Oh, that poor Cyclops. Oh, 
Oh boy. Okay, so this Cyclops is literally currently the only bridge to get over there. Otherwise, it's dropping down to circumvent it and in our way. Uh, I'm sorry, is it Doolahan, not an Alu or whatever the fuck it's called? I would never have imagined that a monster could be like this. Interesting. Well, so much for using him as a thing. Oh, he's climbing up. Oh, oh, good. Where the fuck did he come from? Hey, you're the one who attacked us, you asshole. <laughs> Your dumb face, zap zap, motherfucker. Oh, oh, he's not going for me. Good job, melee group. <laughs> oh, good, a griffin. <laughs> What is that health bar? Sharp incline is as like to throw ah. us off balance as to our enemy. This griffin has no health left. And who the hell is fucking it up? I'll take the points. Shit. Barely did any damage to that thing, and it's, you know, hey. Oh, Jasper and a Griffin Claw. This route has seen better days. But yeah. there's no sense lamenting it. We'll just have to take the long way round. I'm not altogether happy with this. Oof. Oh. That was oh, close. thanks. I've right, got to take the. Yeah. Because the bridge was out. Because the Doolahan fucked up the Cyclops. I know of a treasure chest in this area. The chance you'd like to see it? Ah, uh, sure. Why not? Pray, allow me to open yon chest. Open away. Keeps me from carrying it. Ooh, golden beetle. Apparently missed it last time I was here. 
when I saved those guys from whatever the fuck. Oh, that's right. That's why I was here last time too. Is because they're the, the one time I was here was because those those guards. <gasps> Another beetle. Are you in need of you? If that is not important, just fight and die. Oh good, goblin right next to me. Continue our onslaught, and the behemoth soon topple. Strike fast and true. Apparently, I can't get them with fire. Dude, they are trashing it. Yeah, that the, both of these Espioff and Charcy both have a counterattack. Actually, I think all three of them have counterattacks. And I, if this guy charges you with a counterattack, he just he just immediately is on the ground. If you counter him, he's just that's it. He's charge over. He's on ground, knocked down. Oh right, where are we going? Over here. You're, you're, you're following Espioff. Espioff? It's almost like Jeff, so I feel like I, I should be pronouncing it different, like... Seth, or something, I don't know. So this is basically the village. Oh, cutscene time. For wherever the crap this is. <clears throat> Nameless village, a mysterious settlement. It's so mysterious. Weird camera angle there. More cutscenes. Are you looking to enter the village? Yeah. You best go elsewhere, friend. What's wrong about this place? Okay. There's no business to be had here. That's for sure. That man just now seemed rather on edge. What could he have seen here to inspire such suspicion? I don't know. But he is a merchant. You best go elsewhere, friend. What's wrong about this place? Uh -huh. There's no business to be had here. That's for sure. But you're... Okay. Well, I guess you're not a merchant. Well, it looks like there's an inn. Can I at least do vocation shit? Is that who I think it is? Aye, oh, I reckon so. Rather more common looking than I'd expected. But I suppose that's neither here nor there. It is a question of skill at the end of the day. So you say, but you waged against our visitor, did you not? And I'd do it again. Just look at that fool's face. Well, that's. That's just rude. Well met, sir. How might I be of service? I uh, don't know. Can you? I'll sleep sound tonight. Ah, oh. you must be the visitor I've heard so much about. Have you some uh, business here in the village? I've. I was hoping to talk to a guy there. Vocation shit. Ask about the village. You would know of our village. As you can see, tis a simple place. Tucked away on the eastern edge of Vermond. Yep, that's where we're at. Is there all else I can help you with, sir? What about a guy named Arthur? Arthur. <laughs> Tis a name unfamiliar to me, I'm afraid. Mm-hmm. At least no one by that name lives here, sir. You're all like spies for the Queen, aren't you? Like some weird little village setup. <laughs> As you like, sir. I see our goal has changed. I would not presume to direct. This is the inn. 
We've room to spare if you're looking to spend the night. Of course. Nothing's free in this world. Uh, vocations. And our skills. All right. Core skills levitate, thank God. Augments. Beatitude. Beatitude? 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 I don't know. What, I don't know what that's about. It increases the amount of health recovered by curatives and curative magics. Sure. Why not? And we have high flagger goo goo high eleven yarp, please. High paladadoodly. The amount of people that don't have this ability, considering it's just rank three, is shocking. All right, let's see what you got. Well met, sir. How much well met. have you? You've got, ooh, Bardichi blades. Yo, Charcy half plate. I like the way that looks, and it's pretty good. I'm gonna buy that for you. Or at least it's not bad. <laughs> not a big fan of just giant heads of creatures on, on your sides, you know? Hey, -o. I take it you're the outsider, my lord mentioned. You're my lord? How do you know to expect you? I couldn't tell you. Why not ask him yourself? You'll find him in the manor atop the on hill. Okay, so everyone knew we were arriving. Okay. I mean, they probably just assumed I'd inevitably show up here due to the events of things, I'm sure. It's not weird at all. This definitely won't be an ambush or anything, right? Greetings. I must say I'm impressed by your intuition, sir. You found me out far sooner than most. Than most? I trust you are enjoying your sojourn in our fair village. If you have any questions, ask away. I should be glad to aid you. The village? If aught about our humble village seems strange to you, that is easily explained. For it is here that thieves are instructed in the skills they require. Ah. To begin with, those who wander into the village are evaluated for their potential aptitude. Of course, you are no exception. That you stand here now is proof you were deemed a worthy candidate. Which is to say, you have my approval as the thiefmaster. Ah, cool. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? So this is the guy you learn how to blow yourself up from? Very thief-like. Uh, about the village, ask what he knows of you. Sure. You're curious what I know of you? Quite a bit, I should think. Naturally, I'm not the only one. Our village has its own network of spies and informants, you see. And your title tends to make you stand out among the rumors we collect. Nah, that's fair enough. You're the second arisen to come to Vermont, and you've allied yourself with Captain Brandt against the Queen Regent. That's 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 half true. In response, she's. Oops, I mustn't say another word. Uh, okay. Don't misunderstand. I'm no ally of the Queen Regent. I merely strive to maintain neutrality in political matters. Okay. Those who deal in information must ne'er align themselves with a particular power. Such is our village code. Yeah, it makes sense. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? Sure. What about the false sovereign Arthur? Arthur, you say? Hmm. Is he one of you? I've lived in this village many a year, but I can't say I've heard of someone by that name. My apologies. Ah. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? No, I guess that's it. I take care then. You met the thief Meister at the Hilltop Manor. You, sir, are worthy of inheriting my ultimate technique. I ask the blowing oneself up so your weapons aren't fire. Once mastered, it will allow you to fell all foes, both minuscule and mighty. Take it, and do with it what you will. Okay. 
Why not? I'll just take the thing, and if I ever play as a thief, I'll blow myself up. The blade, the yeah, blades of pyre. That's the that's the yep. Yeah. Don't do that. Give it. You know. Cool. I did it. What about you? Anything to say? Oh, you've a sharp eye. Suppose I ought not to have underestimated you, Sir Arisen. Why would I? What was that? You wonder how I know? For starters, it isn't just me. The entire village recognizes you for what you are, cuz. I mean, I kind of figured. I mean, I, yeah, it was pretty obvious when I walked in. about it. We've our sources, and that's all I'm saying. But don't worry yourself. I'm actually on your side, in a sense. Can't offer you any help, though. Village code and all that. Still, I suppose I could give you a bit of advice. If I were you, I'd try doing to someone else what I was just doing to you. Know what I mean? Standing there? I have a hefty wager riding on you, cuz. Don't let me down, eh? Do to someone else what I just did to you. What could she have meant by that? Well, she was tailing us, I guess. I don't I don't know. This game is incredibly vague half the time. So I'm outside of the circle I'm supposed to be in. Nice seeing you, Pat. Oh shit. You the outsider? My lord spoke of you. I uh, I am. Come on, follow me. I've something real nice to show you. Sure, you're gonna lead me to a bunch of people who are gonna try to mug me. Why can't I move? You're gathering grimoires, eh? My lord told me. Uh huh. I am. I happen to be in possession of the veiled tome, Owl and Blizzard. I already got I'd it. Would even be willing to part with it. If you'd be willing to trade me Fulminous Shield, the magic Aegis for it, that is. What no. say you? Uh, do not have it. No can do. Oh dear. Still haven't found it? Then I'm afraid I'll have to hold on to Howling Blizzard for the time being. Oh, well, I'm afraid I already have the Howling Blizzard, so I don't fucking need yours. Okay, so the little girl ran in here. But like the door is locked. Let me give me let me let me, out, get, let me out of here. But the door is locked, uh, and the door is in. <laughs> uh, it's inside the rock. So I'm assuming there's a cave. They're they're a little abode attaches to. A reason to get up there? Maybe. I'll pick that up. We might have need of it. Let me see here. If I do this. Flicker away. Ooh. Ah. Secret now here's token. a surprise. Our collection grows. Can't get in there. I shall have to inform my own master of this. Oh, well, he's not in here anymore. Where did he go? This looks as if it would fetch a hefty sum. Whether or not we make the sale is for the Arisen to decide. Apparently, it's not a door. The village's stairs are as sharp as daggers. What is their intent, I wonder? Tis eerie, but we must needs press on. So the village elder was here, and now he's not. Could be because I attacked the wall and he freaked out and ran and disappeared, and now he'll, he'll have to wait for him to come back. Oh, no, there he is. Hello again, master guy who just gave me an ability. There's an area down there. 
And there's a secret token. Such a yeah. some tapestry of stars. Right you are. Okay, you cannot. No, do not use wit. No, 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 don't use that. That was my, I guess that was the good, the test. If I am falling like that, I cannot stop myself with the mage spell. I can't float my way down like that, which sucks. That means you can't use, you can't use your mage thing to keep you from dying from a fall. That's pretty poopy. So it's only good for getting down, not, up. nope, can't do that, ow. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Shall we you see don't say. I'd wager there's ought to be found here. We ought to take a closer look. Ah, now here's a surprise. Well, let's see if I can do this. A splendid discovery. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. What the fuck was that jump? Like, Outside something stopped me. I shall have to inform my own master. Okay. Master, well, there is no. Here, I was there's no um. Shall I take us there now? No cave side there. That sucks balls. Is there aught else you care to ask? Sure. Ask about brass. Beg pardon. Why would you ask such a thing? A letter. Oh, -ho. you've made quite the discovery. <laughs> Have I now? Brass means imitating someone in thieves' cant. This letter means to say someone's taken on such a request. Yes. Naturally, I can say nothing as to the who or what of the arrangement. What? I'm sure you understand. Uh-huh. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? No one will ever know I'm here <laughs> with the two giant girls standing, their heads peeking out above the... <laughs> Uh. Oh shit, there's a Wasn't I right here? I was I was right here casting the thing to get up there. I was standing next to a fucking <laughs> Are you kidding me? I was standing next to a hole in the ladder and I didn't notice it. <laughs> okay, this is some thief shit. All right. Ah, ah. Fucking bats. Why are bats so aggressive in this game? Okay. I'm a mage. And the same thing, but now with these things, okay. Isn't like a secret token or a. Hmm. Oh, I can't tell people to follow me. Okay, this is a. You made it after all. Oh, you were the guy at the entrance that was all like, "Don't come up here." Uh, apparently I did. Guess that means I win. Oi, 
You lot best pay up. Dear me. Yay. Man, I, I can't believe I was right on that thing the whole fucking time and didn't notice it. That is sad. Very sad. So I guess I will now talk to you. Hello. You didn't disappoint, did you? You've done well. Seems only fair I answer any questions weighing on you. Go on. Ask away. About the decoy sovereign. Figures you'd want to know about him. Yep. We're supposed to be neutral. Ordinarily, I wouldn't say a word about one of our jobs. But I suppose I can tell you, the situation being what is. His real name is Dora. He was one of us, once. But he's been exiled. We had no choice, see? After he went off to play the false arisen, we're men and women of shadow. Center stage isn't our place to stand. Right. That's why he was cast out. He'll near be part of our village again. That's all you wanted to ask? Uh, ask about this place? What can I say? Not many people bother with this place. Luckily for me, you were different. Knew I was right to bet in favor of the Arisen. Anyway, most visitors get fooled into going up to the manor. We send them packing with a trifle, and if they don't question it, good riddance. Anyone that complacent has got no business being a thief. Right. We only train the rare few who make it here. Some might go so far as to say that the entire village was built around this spot. That all you wanted to ask? For all this, Dara was in line to become the next thief, Maester. Oh. But he failed. Took a massive injury to the chest during the trial. Oof. So the title fell to me. That's when he went off, saying he used the scar in his chest to pose as the Arisen. Oh, well, there you go. And what a scheme that turned out to be, eh? Now he gets to sit pretty on the best seat in the kingdom. Still, you'd have a hard time proving that he's not who he says he is. He's a wily one, that Dara. Always was careful not to leave behind a shred of evidence. But we can't have him thinking that he gets to go off and enjoy a peaceful life in the lap of luxury after breaking our code. Methinks he needs something to remind him of the debt he owes us. Here, this should do the trick. Now, as to the Maester's teaching, not sure you'll be able to use it to its fullest potential, but I'll show it to you. Didn't you already? What? Oh, a second Meisters. Cool. What's this one? So, so is the other Meister like, hey, it's great for combat, but also you light yourself a fire. So, you know, ugh. and then this one is literally actually useful for a thief. Uh, a tome detailing an exceptional ability for thieves. Use it to learn Formless Faint. The Risen's main pawn will also receive the same effect. I'm very curious what that is. I shall use it so I can go look and see what it is. Formless Faint sounds like it's a better version of the counterattack. You know, like you're setting them up to attack you in a way you want them to. So you can counter it for big damage. You're the one then. Fine. I'd hoped I'd not be seeing you here. This guy was happy about it though. Huzzah! Huzzah, indeed. <laughs> and then she's still More clapping. Uh-huh. Just just clap, clap, clapity clap, clap. <laughs> 